Welcome back to Draymond Does Gaming. Draymond here playing more Symphony of War. And today we'll be getting into Chapter 25, Kingdom of Gold. However, I did restructure like everything. <laughs> so, other than Draymond's uh, unit here, Jules, we added in another unit. Um. I don't think we changed Barnabas or Stefan. Diana, what we did, I removed one of their one of her units in the back. I think it was a shooter, a gunner, um, and gave her the Sin Credo because then the leader gets an extra turn. Gave them an extra healer because you know these guys are going to do less damage, but Diana is going to do an extra full turn. So I figured that's a good one. Abigail, we added Sybil's Sybil to. Um, they're still a flying unit, so that's actually super awesome. Raskuja, we added in a healer finally. Lysander, I took out the artillery and just gave him a gunner. Um, Yaromir, I haven't done anything with. Um, but this is where, this is the big part here where things went crazy. Um, Beatrix, I removed the dragon and stuff, added in three frontliners to hopefully help out a little bit there. General Ragavi, which is the new person we just got, um, I went full archers <laughs> and one extra frontliner because I didn't have a healer for them, um, and gave them, I think, the everlasting... No, I didn't give them the everlasting potion. I gave them those because we're full capacity, basically. Um, so we have basically another archer unit, which is very nice. Um, Warlord Tatar kind of changed out his um, completely. Three archers. I'm, I'm going a lot more archer heavy here, which is kind of nice because we could have used a lot of extra archers in that last map. Um, so if we can deploy 20 things again, we'll actually have the squads to do that. Um... Ephraim, I changed around his as well. I removed the gunners, gave him archers. Um, we had enough horses to have a third, um, third cavalry unit. So Godiva is now a cavalry unit. Sir Roland, um, I added in one extra guy. So now there's. Um, there's just one more, so they're just a little bit better. Cloud Render I changed around, so they have the two flying dragons, um, a frontliner, and a healer, and now they're a flying unit, which is amazing. Um, and I gave them the frontline takes less damage, and they get extra movement, so they're going to be super fast. Um, and Matriarch Rosalie, which is the... Uh, mercenary that we just got um we're making her go boom <laughs> couple artillery couple gunners and then one frontliner in front of her to, and she'll heal them and then lord Carneth, um he was just one of our guys that we've had for a while um i kind of had some extra people so i just threw them all into that squad until we can move them around um i want to get one more dragon here um, to really make Cloud Render even more effective, because he's got, he's got capacity. And look at that threat rating, is 17,000. That's like, I think it's the most <laughs> threat. Oh no, Abigail's is now the most threat, because they've, they've got Azura's. Uh, okay. So with that, um, being said, we're gonna enter... Chapter 25, Kingdom of Gold. And you know what? I'm actually going <laughs> to I'm gonna save it right here because I did just finish all that stuff offline, but I didn't, know, didn't save it. So I want to make sure that nothing happens and, you know, we've got that there. So let's get into this next mission. Yeah, so <laughs> there we go. Deploy limit one of 20. Um, so I'm very glad that we were able to do that. No story or anything? 
Oh, Sayuna Palace. Okay. So we're going to be going for that. Iron Mine. Denari Temple. Reza. This is just another little town there. Um, one treasure chest. Two, three treasure chests. Oh, interesting. Need a flying unit to get over here. Okay. Lots of cavalry. Um, all right. So let's uh, check out this info. Cause at least Sayuni squads to surrender. Is that more of these ones? How do you... Yeah, probably these guys. Girls, I should say. Okay. So we just want to be careful of that. So we want to make sure that they surrender. Okay. That should be pretty straightforward. Um, how do we want to do this? Oh, like Lysander, um, Ephraim, Lant, Barnabas, um, Godiva, go Abigail, Cloud Render, there's Jules, um, Raskuja, Stefan. Alright, then at this point it's more just let's get them all out there. Who else do we still need? Yaromir. Warlord Tatar. Four. 12, Matriarch, and Lord Tornus. So we can actually get them all out. We still have capacity for two more, but we kind of ran out of money trying to get them all going. So let's do this. Oh, I should have checked to see how long we had um, as well. Turn one. Um, mission info, 11 turns. Okay. I just kind of want to move people up then. Let them kind of come to us. I'll just send Abigail that way, but I think Abigail is going to be extremely helpful over here. So, we could send Cloud Render that way, but we don't have to yet. Can send Cloud Render like way over here though. Same thing like Godiva, Raskuja. Sorry, I'm just. Um, oh, getting. <laughs> Getting message here, so. Alright, we're just, like I said, we're just gonna be moving people up. Wait. Beatrix. Wait. Gonna get up to there. Stefan. There we go. Yeah, that was Yaromir, because he actually can't move that far, even though he's um, got the horse. So. Alright. Okay. Let's see what they do. Oh, they're trying to shoot us. I see that's worked out so well for them. Yeah, they are. It couldn't remember if they could get that far with their attacking, so. 
or with their bows, I should say. Yeah, well, here they come. Well, this is good because those guys need the XP. Okay. Oh yeah, that's right, we got the thing, so if they're around here, they'll heal every, every, um, go in the more, um, okay. We're going to attack in here, and then we're going to try to make them surrender. Uh, we're probably not going to be able to make them surrender. So we'll wait there. We could go there and then have you come in to try and surrender them. Nope, that's not going to work. So who do we want in front there? Probably... Rolant. They're fearful. And we're good. No surrender. Okay. Yeah, well. Could have been worse. Um, we'll wait right there. Okay. So some of our weaker guys in terms of like this stuff will want to get get them to go first. Um even like Beatrix can probably go here and blast them. Nice. It's actually pretty good for her. Okay. I'd like to... I don't know what I'd like to do yet. You can get in there and just blast them, but I don't want you to. Oh, well, we can attack this way, so we will. Oh, nice. Um... Yeah, we'll do this. This should be a good hit in here. Yeah. Perfect. Raskuja can get up to these guys, so let's do that. Nice. Very good. I think we just take Lysander here then and do this. Because they're going to be pretty defensible. Abigail can just kind of move up here and just start blasting people. Blast them with your dragons and breath. And go! Destroy! That's kind of what I want to do here as well against these archers with Cloud Render. Nice. So we're not taking. We're not going to be doing a lot of damage with him. 
but it's still going to be good. Okay, now we can use like Meteor on some of these guys. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, it hits four of them. Yeah, it'll be good. Ephraim can just come right up here. I'm surprised he couldn't get that kill. Um, Yaromir, let's just bring you up. Thing, Warlord Tatar can actually take on this guy, so we'll do that. Nice. Godiva. Honestly, we want you to come around here, charge these guys, and then you can retreat back. Because you're not quite where we want you to be yet. Anyone need some healing? Uh, yeah, we can do that. Matriarch Rosalie can get up here with this mess of people. Lord Kurt can also get up here and wait. And then, yeah, we are going to use the Exemplar on Lysander. They're still fearful. Okay. Um, I could make someone go again. Just... You know what? We're going to be getting a lot of these. So let's have Cloud Render go again. And try to take out this guy. There we go. There. That's going to make that archer much less effective. Okay. Yeah, this should be fine. Perfect. Nice. In fact, we should be able to make that one surrender here. That's not too bad. Nice. Perfect. That's going to be some good levels for Lysander's crew. Need one more gunner on him. Or another healer. Would be nice. Good. Anytime we can take out their leaders, that's a good thing. Oh, he came through us. Oh, he didn't come through us. He came through them. Ah, yeah, that makes sense. All right. Well, I'm glad I gave them exemplar here. Because they are taking quite a few hits. Ooh, Rascuja. Well, he took out their entire squad, though, so that's okay. I'm happy with that. Now that should put... Yeah, look, we can already use Exemplar again. Okay. Force Surrender... Perfect. 
then they can at least come over here and we can wait. I do want to see if that was capture at least three so we don't know. All right, Barnabas, you get up here. Actually, before we do this, I should probably make somebody. Oh, you know what? Here, we're going to use the terror. Here. Nice, that's a big one we can probably make them surrender then. We definitely can make them surrender. Um, I kind of want to use that before we get going up. So I could put Exemplar back on Lysander as well. So there we go. Um, yeah, we'll just blow these guys all to hell. Nice. Try to force these guys to surrender as much as we can. They didn't surrender. Okay, well, that's unfortunate. We'll make these guys surrender, though. Perfect. Okay, now what do we do here? Probably come down like this to blast these guys. There, just take out that squad. Perfect. Because then Godiva can run up that way. But first, before we do that, I kind of want to start blasting people over here. <laughs> um. I think we just do this over here. That should be fine. Okay. You attack in on these guys. Nice. Very good. Mostly dealt with. I'd like to wait right there. And then we can shoot them. Just take them out. Nice. Um, we have, Okay, we've caused at least three of them to surrender. Okay, I wasn't sure if we had to surrender. And I wasn't sure who we had to surrender. Let's put it that way. Let's go here and start smashing these guys. Nice, very nice. Raskuja can come up here. Nice, very nice there too. Um, Diva can get all the way up to here and just take them out. Nice. Aldor's Tower Shield. That sounds cool. Stay strong, everyone. 
like to move you in here to just attack these guys. Yeah, there you go. Take out two of their archers. Very good. Yeah, I think we do this. <laughs> That's so close. Oh well. Okay. So Lysander, I do need... to take out somebody. Nice. Okay. Yaromir can get in here. Attack that way. Perfect. Means you can get in here and attack that way. Perfect. So you can get in here and attack that way. And we're just basically continuing this. Um, now we can also use some of these powers like terror and the blessing. Maybe on Abigail. Help maybe break this up here. Hmm. Yeah, because they're going to be tough. Yeah. That's going to be tough. And then look at that, we can Meteor again. We might as well do this line. Perfect. Alright. And we're looking pretty good. There we go. Interesting. Cyrene's regalia. Interesting. I don't know what that is. Ooh, that could have hurt. And that did hurt. That's okay. Is that that squad is kind of like our weakest. Okay. Attack these guys, try and take them all out. Nice. Maybe we can force them to surrender. Nice. That's huge. Look at those levels. We're going to seize this. Abigail can make it up to here and start blasting in this way. Nice, no more healers. Very good. Um... I'm tempted to 
to do this. And just start grabbing these and then giving you exemplar. So if these guys attack you, they won't they shouldn't kill you. Move you in over here as far as we can, because you can basically wipe out a squad every time. It's so good. There we go. Just wipe them out. Very good. Extra money. We need it right now. There we go. Yaromir can make it all the way over here, so that's great. Oh, oh, we got him with the extra blast of fire. Nice. If we do this, can we force these guys to surrender? Nice, that'll be good. They need that. Yeah, no, you don't need a heal, so we'll wait. Oh, and also, blast them again here. Blast those guys. Just, we just need to do, like, enough damage to them, right? Atriarch starting to move this way. Gudiva. You should probably heal yourself. There we go. Ephraim, you're getting there, bud. <laughs> so slow. Anyone need a heal here? No. Okay. I think we're good. Very nice. I was wondering if they could reach us there. Destroyed. Lovely. Well, this is what I wanted. And draw them down there a bit. There we go. Next two turns, we can grab those. Um, I'd like to just go up this way with you. Let's just start doing some heals because Raskuja can make his way up here and take out this. Perfect. Perfect. So who do we want to blast in here? Maybe Beatrix? All right. Pretty good. Happy with that. So I'd like Jules to get like all the way up here and just start blasting them. 
Nice. Those archers are destroyed. Um, who needs some extra XP and stuff? Poor Lord Tatar needs to heal. There we go. It was something. <laughs> Matriarch Rosalie, you haven't I don't think you've even attacked yet, so let's just take them out. Oh, you did attack the once. All right. Tiny bits of damage there. All right, Lysander, you can take this. Now what? Ooh, well, we can terror them because why not? Um. You're like one space away. That's crazy. Wait there. You don't have a healer is why. Okay. So we'll move you there. Put Diana here. So we can heal you. There we go. Wait. Godiva, though, can come in here and attack these guys, so we'll do that. We get that charge bonus, and then we can retreat to there. And then we can do this. Just heal up everybody. We'll do a power exemplar on us. And end our turn. There we go. Looking pretty good so far. Big levels. And now they're stuck there. Which is fine. And now we get some free heals when they shoot at us. Okay. All in all, not bad. Let's go grab this treasure bowman ship. Nice. Well, we'll just get up here and take out these archers with Abigail. Nice. I really want to just take them out. just so we can get by them. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, because these guys are all going to hurt. Um, we'll meteor in there again. So they're all down to like half health, which will be very good for us. I think we do this. Take out that squad, basically. Then I think we um, bless. Come down here and do it to these guys. Nice. 
Diana can get right up in here and start smashing faces. <laughs> so many extra attacks. It's fantastic. Godiva can get in here. Really, you left one alive? We get to there. Hmm. No one else can really get in there, eh? Well, Ephraim at least can get here and attack them with some archers. It's something. There we go. You guys get some XP. I guess we could teleport, like, Yaromir in here. Yeah, let's do that. We have a teleport. Might as well use it. Very good. And then everyone else is just kind of getting up. Yeah, I'll we'll do some healing. There we go. True shot bow, all right, take that. Ooh, that's rough. Wasn't expecting the ambush. This could actually go very bad. Yeah. This could actually go extremely bad. Wow. Okay. <laughs> well, let's redo that turn. Mm, that's never happened yet, so that's good to know. So they can ambush us all in here. So we need to do something slightly different. Um, first off, Get the treasure. We can get in here, blast their archers just like we did last time. Crystal Lance, very good. Perfect. These guys are gone, out of our way. We're still going to use the Meteor. Because that really hurts them. We want to get people in over here to, like, take them out. Maybe we move Diana in to start smashing. Maybe that's just what we do. to come up in here and start smashing their faces. Very good. And then we have Diana in there. Hmm. No, I don't really want you there. I want someone else that can get, like, in here. Okay. Yaromir can get in there. And do 
something at the very least. Okay. All right. Not very great, but it's something. Then we can move out of the way. Lysander can come in, blast them. Okay. Still think we come in here. Because we just take out so much of them. Hmm. I think we just blast them with some artillery. You guys still come up here. Perfect. Everybody else moves forward, but what else do we do? Maybe we bless Diana to go again here. So she can be up in here and just smash around some more of these guys. Because they're already all pretty weak. And then we have to teleport again. So let's do this, and Stefan can get in. And take them out, which is actually kind of huge. Anyone need healing? Sure. Then we can actually send Beatrix right into here. and heal up your own person. There we go. I think I think this will be fine now. There we go. Okay. This could hurt, but it's Stefan versus us. <laughs> there we go. See, this is fine. That's that's okay. All right. Proof of merit. Okay. Blast in this way. Just take these guys out. Can't quite reach there. We get to the Donari Temple though. So let's do that. Uh, meteor. You know he dropped it on one of these guys. In fact, we can't drop it on any of them. We'll do that. Just hurt them a bit. We can terrorize them though. Okay. Let's 
Ephraim can actually get up in here now. Something for these guys. Matriarch again can also get up in here. Godiva, I'd like to just get forward. There we go. Um. Yeah, Jules, you kind of need you getting forward as well, but might as well take a pot shot. Perfect pot shot. Siphon can make it up there. Everybody else moving forward. Alright. Should be okay. Yeah, there we go. Rascuja. All right, we are going to use Exemplar on Diana because she can reach and she's going to start attacking in. Nice. Two guys left. And then we can also move us up here. Probably should heal, so let's do that. Perfect. And then we are good to go. We're almost done this one. Oh, they've got artillery. Yeah, that's going to be rough. Go seize that iron mine. Um, Lysander can get all the way up here, so we will. Okay. Godiva can get in here and attack and then retreat. Because I think I still want Diana up here. Um, I think we can just attack in with Diana though. Yeah. There we go. We took out one guy with Diana. If we go here, we actually can't do anything. So we want to have Barnabas here. There we go. We can wait. Cloud Render can make his way up. Um, where's Abigail? Okay, so she actually can't get too much there. Love to get jewels in. Nope, we're just good. We can just wait. Same thing, Matriarch, actually Matriarch can reach in there. So we might as well, maybe we'll get... Uh, yeah, we didn't get a kill. We were close though. Um, and then really everybody else, I think we're okay. So, oh, actually we can go again with somebody. So Diana, that's you.
stop them. Very good, actually. Perfect. Um... We can also then just teleport her out. There's only two of them and three of them. Perfect. That, that went a lot nicer and smoother. Perfect. Who do I want to take this? Maybe Jules? Or Godiva? Yeah, let's go Godiva. More uh, loyalty for her is good. It's needed. Chapter complete. Alright. Lots of surrenders. Huge. Very good for us. Throne room, so you in a royal palace. Please step aside. Ugh. Xanatus, take me. Suffer an eternal hell, pretender. Jules, please come to me. What's going on? You are the descendant of King Dargon, the true rulers of our nation. It was thought that their dynasty had ended. However, we, the scions of Dargon, have spent three generations on a mission to restore the Dargon family. You, his great-great-grandson, are to be our king. Oh, that's a revelation. Well, you know there was something between them. And now we know what it was. We cannot reveal your identity, not even to you. There are many powerful forces who have wanted you dead, but the time has come for you to claim a rightful place on the throne. Draymond. Don't look at me. It seems to me you should have a seat on that nice thro throne there, friend. This doesn't feel right. I did nothing to deserve to rule over anyone. The people have wished this for longer than in living memory. We of the Scions of Dargon have taken many lives and endured much to get to this point. You must accept your fate, my king, for the future of our homeland. I always knew you were a noble spirit. Can't think of a more deserving soul to randomly become a king. Don't worry about it, and figure out the details later. Narima. I wish for my people to join the fight against the Empire of Arculus. Can this happen? It shall be done. Well, there we go. The shrine's been calling my name since we've set foot in this land. Guess I'll see what the judging heavens have in store for the likes of me. I'm as surprised as you. Going down. Interesting. Oh, a giant sword. Nice.
and wings. All right. Holy mackerel, am I glad to be back. Give me some time to really think, you know, about what I'm doing in this life. Really? And what have you concluded? Does a new clean living Stefan stand before us? Oh, you mean the drinking, the flirting, and the thieving? Likely to continue, friend. No, no, think bigger. Some give me a label thief, but look around us. We live in a world of schemers, snakes, and dealmakers. At least the thief bears his soul to the world for all to see without all the misdirection. They should make me the patron saint of truth itself, I tell ya. You. You're as eloquent as they come, Miss Stefan. Ah, no patience for a little philosophy, I see. Well, how about this? Very nice. Now you're almost as fast as your lightning quick wit. <laughs> yeah. Wait a minute. Mirage. Okay. Well, there we go. We've completed chapter 25. Only one small hiccup there. That's not so bad. The first time that uh, that's ever happened. In the dramatic turns of events, Ayuna's Dargon dynasty has returned to the throne. The newly coronated king, fulfilling the wishes of his people, declares Sayuna as an ally of the Nephilim army, dedicates its resources to the war with the Empire of Arculus. The war is turned against Casimir, having been defeated time and time again around the world, their resources have been stretched thin, which has drastically reduced their area of control. The main Imperial armies have pulled out of the fringe territories to protect the heartlands. The Philom army is yet to encounter the first Imperial army, a powerful force of elite cavalry that went undefeated in Arculus Wars of Conquest. Before them lies Stormrook, a mighty fortress that has been the gateway to the rich lands of the core of Viridia. The Imperial army has dug itself in deep and marshaled the entirety of their legions in expectation of a full-scale invasion by Draymond. Seeking to strike at the Imperial Heartlands before they have time to regroup, Draymond leaves Ezram to attack the enemy stronghold at Stormrook. Capture Stormrook in the gleaming rich city of Remorg would seal the fate of the Empire that stands before them. Alright, that's kind of huge. Um, just wanted to check out this Mirage. Light, three stealth attacks at one range. Um, and no special. Okay. <laughs> uh, conversations. Holy moly. Beatrix and Jules. Adelia and Lysander. Narima and Jules. Um, I think I'd rather do this than that one. Because I'd like them to be bonded. So I believe you only get like one choice here, right? They can't be bonded to two people, so let's do this one. My king, all is well. The Darkling Dynasty is restored. I'll never get used to that. Especially coming from you, Narima. You must embrace your heritage. Our people are desperate for a return to glory of old. Do not worry, we of the Scions of Dargon will not leave your side. Thanks so much, but please, you've done so much of the work. All I did was be born. She still refer to me as Jules. That is another matter. The name Jules was given to you by Viridian Aristocracy. It's not a proper name for a Sayuni king. May I suggest Kazim, the name of your great-grandfather, the first descendant of Dargon who was denied the crown? King Kazim of Dargon? Well, let me think about it. Have you considered acquiring a queen to pass on your royal lineage? Acquiring? <laughs> not yet. I implore you to take a Sayuni woman, a tender, pretty one. When you have time, you'll find that Sayuna is overflowing with them. Oh, okay. Well, what about you? You're a Sayuni woman, are you not? My king, I am hardened by war. I could not provide a warm haven for you to rely upon as a man. Sayuni men like you are traditional and would be better served. But I'm not like them at all. I love that you're tough and determined like a war goddess. Please don't think about that. Even with all you've been through, you've never lost sight of your life's work. I've never admired as one as much as I do you. You are seen as greatest hero. 
You humble me, Jules. Your face, you face tremendous challenges. I will let you fall back into me for refuge whenever you need, forever and beyond, my king. Interesting. Okay. And then Adelia, someone we haven't seen in a while. Hello, Sister Adelia. I hope I'm not disturbing you. Not at all, General. Please, just Adelia. I wonder if you indulge me in regarding the Denari Temple, the Sisterhoods of Mercy and Justice. You are Diana's bonded. Yes, I am. But in that regard, I am a failure. Why? A Sister of Mercy is tasked as the guardian of the Paladin's children. Her ch child remains missing. Could he have prevented that tragedy? It would seem not. Thank you, but to the devoted to the temple, it does not matter why, only what happens. I can, however, continue to fulfill my duty to support Diana in her adventures of warfare. Tell me, are you a follower of Dunar? I'm not a devotee, though I do recognize its value. I lament the Dunari temple's erosion to the spread of nihilism and cult worship. Ah, but you are academic. Probably could not bring yourself to believe in anything supernatural. Nay, I have seen the absence of the temple has filled the people's hearts with banality, making them vulnerable. They subconsciously desire a return to traditionalism, but they will receive instead um, is the Iron Fist of Tyranny, which will feel just the same. It's very astute, General. Please, Lysander, will you? Adelia, how do you feel about the temple policy on sanctioned breeding for lack of a better term? In a female... Acolyte has become devoted warrior and purveyor of the temple of the outside world. She must be of high caliber. The temple considers physical ability, mental acuity, mortal morale, fortitude. The sisterhood of mercy is wedded to her faith, the temple and her bonded, and most of all, her bonded's children. Someone like me would never qualify pro for procreation. They wish only to allow the greatest features to pass on the next generation of acolytes. Begging your pardon, but someone like you, why ever not? We of the temple do not ask why. The traditions exist for the betterment of the world and the heavens. That's why sisters avoid associating with men. Well, yes, it would distract us more from our more important duties. Men of the temple are severely punished for tempting a sister of mercy. Ah, men of the temple. And what about men who are not of the temple? Lysander, are you trying to tempt me? I wouldn't dream of it, but I would like to get to know you much more thoroughly. Thoroughly? What an interesting choice of words from an, such an interesting man. Please stay a while, Lysander. <laughs> oh, boy. Uh, all right. And we've got tech. We have tech. Um, we're definitely getting plus 10 squad capacity. And we're definitely getting this and that. Um, and artillery attacks have splash damage. That means we open up everything else. All artifacts cost minus one. That's actually super nice. All right, so plus one range to siege cannons. Industrial furnace. We are now able to maintain high energy blast furnace, allowing for far efficient processing material. Minus one iron and obsidian cost for all units. That's a huge we should get that the advanced firearms grant our gunners and dragoons an additional attack i think we go that and that out of anything here so that's fantastic um marketplace stephanie sabine jeffrey nazer jasper and that's it so nothing really crazy here Ooh, more iron more gems, more horses, and magic stuff. Okay, heart seeker. Um, I don't really need another imperial war banner. Is actually kind of nice, but beyond that, I don't think we need much. Um, and then organizing the army, we can start to do this anyone else that can level up a bit or upgrade their class Zwyhander, yeah another one why not look at that 
He needs like one more person here. Oh, look at this. Um, oh, he actually can't get them to soldiers. Interesting. Or acolytes. Oh, because we're out of iron. Okay. Well, we might as well still um, do this and get them something. You can always change their classes later on. There we go. Oh, look at this. Archers, yes, please. And you can actually go into a archer as well. Nice. Look at this. Look at that. These squads, they got some good levels. All right. Um, and you. Honestly, I'd like you to probably be this for now. We can change you back. Holy moly, everybody. This is fantastic. We're going to do so much more damage this way. In like one, one battle, and they're all um, leveling up. It's fantastic. That's huge too. Oh man, so many. This is great, great. I say. You can go sword fighter for now. And there we go. All right, that was nice. Everybody's leveled up. Next time we're going to be going into Storm Rook. It's probably going to be a pretty tough fight, so be extra cautious there. But thanks again for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.